what is going on one I am here and today I'll be showing you how to get a Windows Vista and a Windows 7 kind of uh, uh, window borders and window title bar um, thing in Linux. so this sovereign system as you can see has a blur behind and uh, the kind of a glass while moving and stuff and uh, yeah this operating system is elementary OS so if I go to uh, details if I have a new window here go to details about here we go if I go to about um, it is elementary OS version 2.0 Luna and uh, yeah so this should work on Ubuntu 12.04 and onwards uh, but I'm not sure with Ubuntu 12.04 just because I tried adding the background blur and it didn't kind of work uh, but uh, yeah anyway so let's just get started first of all we're gonna go ahead and install the Emerald Theme Manager so go ahead and Google search Emerald Theme Manager PPA and then go ahead I'm gonna have the PPA into the description so it should be somewhere around here um, you can see some themes um, scroll a little bit down uh, here we go this is the commands uh, this is a PPA um, I'm gonna have it in the description then you gotta do a sudo apt-get update and then install emerald now after you have done that you need to install compis if you don't already have it Ubuntu already has it but elementary OS don't um, so we're gonna go ahead and open the software center and we're gonna go ahead and click on the search type compis and then we're gonna go ahead uh, to tick everything compis and OpenGL window compositing manager compis and compis, compis config settings manager compis fusion icon doesn't seem to be working that well so I don't really get it uh, but uh, yeah anyway so after we have done that, we're gonna go ahead to this Compis Config Compis Config Settings Manager. If you don't see it anywhere around here, you're gonna type CCSM on the uh, CCSM, and it'll find Compis Config Settings Manager. Or you, or you can run the command at the command line, and it'll still open that. So yeah, um, now we're gonna go ahead. We need the animation add-on and the reflection and the blur windows so we're gonna go ahead and add the extras so we're gonna go ahead and open the terminal and type in for Ubuntu 12.04 we're gonna type sudo apt-get install confis fusion plugins extra or if you're on Ubuntu 12.10 and onwards uh, we're gonna type sudo apt-get install confis plugins and that should install um, these uh, plugins so now we are almost done um, to make um, this, to get the Vista or 7 theme, we have gotta go to um, GNOME look and then um, we're gonna go ahead, as you can see, I candy for GNOME desktop. We're gonna go to Compis. But that is the first the Vista reflection add on. Um, so we, ne we also need the Vista theme. Couldn't find it but um, uh, I'm gonna have the link in here you just copy the download link then we're gonna go ahead to the Vista reflection add-on which as you can see adds behind the uh, blur it has this kind of it feels so much like Windows when you have that background and then like you see the terminal it just it's just so weird so you gotta download it it's gonna go ahead if you click on download it's gonna open something um, as a PNG file we're gonna go ahead and save the image and then we're gonna save it onto our um, uh, downloads wherever you want to save it and I've already have this so yeah um, now what we're gonna need to do first we're gonna enable compis so we're gonna go ahead and do is gonna open the terminal and then type in compis slash uh, dash dash whatever replace we're gonna go ahead and press enter and then it will start changing the theme it will be quite different it won't have the theming uh, right there now we're gonna type emerald slash whatever replace and now 
we should have emerald on now it's gonna be different it's gonna have a bluish kind of thing that's at least that's what it's in elementary OS it's gonna be blue so we're gonna go ahead and open emerald theme manager and now we're gonna go to the downloaded file and then we're gonna go ahead and click on the download file we're gonna import if we're on here to our downloads and then we're gonna go ahead Vista Q Emerald we're gonna click on open it'll be like this now if you click it it won't have the reflection it won't have the blur it won't have anything um, but that's okay because we're gonna change it now we're gonna go to the Emerald settings and be sure to have the use button fade and not the use button fade pulse if you want to be more like Windows 7 Vista um, and then show tool tips for buttons it basically says close window maximize window minimize window and stuff we don't want that um, now compass decoration blur type gonna go ahead to the title bar only and then button uh, hover cursor to normal and then title bar double click action to maximize restore because it's basically on shade it does this kind of uh, animation but uh, if you double click it here we go normal now we're gonna go ahead and quit it and open confis config exciting spanger um, now we're gonna go ahead to the uh, effect and to the reflection now we're gonna go ahead to the reflection image press this little button and then go ahead to downloads and then the 106.117 reflection.png that we saved Arial, 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 earlier and we're gonna go ahead click on that click on open and it'll be like this and then we need uh, to have moving reflection is already on um, so yeah that's what we have to do just click on enable reflection now we should have the glass, glass thing now if you're in Ubuntu 12.04 and if you try to open let's say the file manager and this does an update and stuff that means it will not work you gotta log out, log in back, uh, look back in and then the reflection kind of thing will not work at all so if I click on back now we're gonna go ahead to the blur windows we're gonna click on that and then alpha blur windows we're gonna go ahead and type title bar and then alpha blur is ticked and then blur filter when you want the Gaussian with whatever <laughs> however you pronounce it and the Gaussian radius on 10 so that should have the blur now we'll click on enable blur windows is the moment of truth if it works that is fine if it doesn't work don't try this it's just um, Ubuntu has some problems in this and maybe other distributions have these same problems and yeah so that's how you add the blur and um, yeah this feels so much like Windows 7 or like it tricks you into thinking that it's kind of different with the design <laughs> yeah uh, so yeah that's basically um, it that's basically how to have a Windows Vista or a Windows 7 kind of uh, title bar or window border window decoration however you wanna say it and uh, yeah so thanks for watching if I helped you please a like I highly appreciate all of support and uh, yeah so um, a like will be greatly appreciated let's see if we can get to three likes yeah thanks so much for watching and I will catch you all later stay awesome